Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and my name is Catherine and I'm going to be giving you guys the top 5 things to do in Colombia. So let's get started. Coming at number 1, Medellin. Medellin, also known as the eternal spring city, which is perfect for its temperatures ranging from 65 to 78 Fahrenheit. They have a flower festival held in the summertime. And this is a beautiful festival with different parades of different type of flower arrangements. It's very beautiful to see. When visiting Medellin, take a visit to a pueblito paisa that has a beautiful colonial town and you can see beautiful views of Medellin city. And the Mall of Santa Fe is an awesome place to shop or just hang out with friends. It is a very cool mall. Also, Medellin has a vibrant nightlife and you can visit Parque Lleras or La Sesenta and they have a lot of different bars and dancing places that you can go to. Coming at number two, Antioquia. Antioquia is a department in the northwest Colombia lying mostly within the Andes Mountains and extending towards the Caribbean Sea. It is home to Medellin, which is the department's capital. It is also home to Guatapé, which is a beautiful colonial town with its main tourist attraction being La Piedra del Peñón, and it is east of Medellin. And it's actually not too far. It's about like three hours from Medellin. If you want to take a bus or if you drive, you, have, you rent a car, it's about two hours. Another town in the department of Antioquia to visit would be San Rafael, known for its mountain views, waterfalls, and Cascada La Cazuela. Coming at number three, Cartagena. Cartagena is a port city on Colombia's Caribbean coast. They have the walled old town founded in the 16th century with a colorful colonial building. You can see the whole town by walking or taking a tour by horse and carriage. And taking this uh, tour is actually re really recommended because they'll take you all around. They have different prices ranging from like 20 minutes to 30 or one hour. And they'll take you to all the famous people's houses. Like they passed us by Shakira's house as you can see right here. It was really cool. And another place to visit in Cartagena is the island of Baru, with this main beach being Playa Blanca. And of course, no trip to Cartagena is complete without visiting Islas del Rosario. It is an archipelago located off the coast of Colombia, 100 kilometers from Cartagena. It's known as one of the 46 natural national parks of Colombia. Coming at number four, Cali. And Cali is what your girl is from. Cali is in El Valle del Cauca department and it was founded in 1536 and it's known for salsa dancing and its many clubs and parks. Visit the Cat Park which is along the river in Cali, which is a nice park to visit with the family. And Choro del Indio is a beautiful waterfall in the outskirts of Cali where people go to cool off for Cali's heat. And then there's Mirador Sebastián Balcazar and it's where you can get a beautiful view of Cali City. And let's talk about uh, Cali's nightclubs. Uh, Cali's nightclubs, one of them is called La Tolandra, where you can do a lot of practice your salsa dancing. Or they have a living nightclub, which is more for like the younger people. Some older people go there too, but it's more for like the urban, hip people, like hip hop type of people. And last but not least, Quindío. It's another department of Colombia, and it's in the central region of the country. The capital of Quindío is Armenia, and it is famous for its coffee plantation, colorful architecture, when visiting Quindío, take a tour of Parque del Café, which is a coffee theme park with rice for the kids to enjoy, while the adults enjoy a cumbia show of coffee, and of course, no trip is complete without trying different types of coffees. And Salento, known for its coffee estates and beautiful scenery. They also have a Cocora Valley, which is home to the world's tallest palm trees, measuring up to 200 feet tall. Horseback riding trip today to the Cocora Valley. How beautiful it is. Another place to visit is Armenia, which is the capital of Quindío and it has beautiful scenery. And it also has a big shopping market to buy anything from souvenirs, coffee, traditional Colombian clothes, as well as the hip and trendy Colombian jeans that gives every girl the right curves and right lifts they are looking for. And trust me, those jeans are real cute. I have like about 80 pairs of them. Every time I go to Colombia, I have to come back with like 20 of them. Okay, and that was it for the top five things to do in Colombia. And if you guys have any questions, comment below. Or if you feel like I left something out that should be seen in Colombia, let me know in the comments below. Hey guys, and be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm always uploading new videos every week. Support the channel.